today I'm going to be putting another LiPo battery or lithium polymer battery out of its misery. This is a, an old defective 6 cell lithium polymer pack, 2600 milliamp hours or 2650 to be exact. Again, one of the cells in here is kind of defective. Most of the other cells are okay, but eh, we're just going to dispose of it. And usually the safe way to dispose of these is discharging them. Well, we're not going to discharge it the conventional way, no. We're going to do it with an automotive load tester rated to 500 amps. So we're going to show what over-discharging one of these at a higher current rate would be like. Because I've already shown what sticking a pinhole in one does, overheating one in an oven, overcharging. Now we're going to do over-discharging and over-current. So, first thing I need to do is I'm going to snip those leads, trim them, hook up the meter, and then we're going to put the load on. So, let's get that going. Okay, the battery is inside the cinder block. The wires are stripped, the cables are hooked up. All I'm going to do now is just put a load on the meter and we'll just back away. Of course, it's kind of burning up my clamps. It's getting burning up. Let's take a look at the aftermath. Yeah, 
And as you can see, there ain't much left of a battery in there. As I say, just that quick high current load we just put on there blew that battery pretty quick. And you can see the paint that melted off my alligator clip. Uh, it's looking a little sad. But there you go. Another LiPo battery put out of its misery, this time severely over-discharging over-current. <laughs>